la 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 Are y'all focused on the self? Because that's what it's about. Are you focused on your peace, your happiness, your time, and where you spend it? Because it's expensive. Those things, once you give them all away, it's hard to get them back. But the lesson that we learn and we take from over exerting those energies. You understand? Are the lessons that build us the most. So with that said, hey boo hey, if it's your first time viewing my channel. I'm Mocha. Also if this is your first time viewing my channel, check this out. I cuss. So if cussing don't work for you, maybe this is not your channel. I don't love you no less. I love you a long time. There's many beautiful readers on YouTube. Most some of them are my soul family. So, they will definitely resonate with you without the cussing. Alright, so this will be for my Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, as well as the Cross Watchers for the sign of Leo. If you need a personal reading, that information can be found within the description. To all of my new subscribers, welcome to the family, y'all. We are the dysfunctional. We don't fight, we don't fuss. We leave that shit on other people's channel, alright? But we do cuss. We love, we enlighten, we share, we grow, we evolve. Posy vibes only over here, alright? So, um, that said, my old subscribers, what the hell y'all been doing? Family! What's up? Familia, what's good? What do y'all what y'all got going on? You have to let it go. Let it burn. Let it burn. Family, let it burn. Gotta let it burn. Burn down. Time to let it burn that. Let it, do you feel the burn lines? Okay? Somebody said we when I burn this mother down. Okay? Burn it down. Faulty foundations, they got to go. This is the season of assets or liabilities. Okay? Let's rock. Thank you, y'all, for all the likes, the shares, the subscribes. I truly appreciate it. Thank you for allowing me to share my light, my love, and my wisdom with you all, as well as my gift. I truly appreciate it. Y'all, we family. Ain't no judgment over here or no flexing. We just get it how we live. And that's what the journey is about. I love y'all. Let's rock. So, Spirit, what do you have to say for my lovely lines between the 15th and the 30th of November? What's the Spirit message? Yeah, me. Some of you guys are reflecting over the past. Woulda, coulda, shoulda. Okay? But it's really not about, and I feel like some of you all, Spirit is trying to move you into a beautiful, grounded place. Some of y'all are needing to be more grateful during this time. Your third eye chakra is booming. Some of y'all going to have to leave people behind in order to truly get your heart's true desires. Some of you all, Leo, some of y'all are just really, y'all have to relinquish, let go of control. Once you let it go and stop, like I told Taurus, once you let it go and stop kicking and screaming and fighting, big signs. Y'all are kind of being forced into change. And there's changes that you're really not comfortable with. However, they're going to bring beautiful things into your world if only you just choose to embrace them instead of fight them so damn hard. Okay? But some of you, it's about you. All of y'all, it's about Leo. And how you're seeing it, how you're seeing certain situations, you know, from your past. I feel like some of y'all during this time, you really need to, need to watch your thoughts. Because they are manifesting at a very quick rate, okay? At a very fast pace. And I feel like it's the way that you see things. During this time, a lot of y'all are going to take the damn rose colored glasses off. You're going to be able to see things from a different perspective, a new way. Some of you all want to focus on the negative out of a situation. But Spirit is calling you during this time to see the light in the situation. Not the negative factors. And see how this will bring beautiful balance into your world. Some of you all are really needing to balance your home and your work life. Some of y'all are really needing to make time for spirit every day. Every day in order to attain that peace you've been praying for. Spirit hear you. But what are you willing to give back? 
What are you willing to sacrifice? Is it show? Is it negative people in your life that really don't add to the add to the growth that spirit is trying to bestow upon you? Some of y'all need to get out in nature. While in nature, will you receive a hell of a download? I'm saying this new moon energy in Scorpio activated something within you guys that I feel like it's kind of going to force you to move towards. What it is that you're passionate about. You're going to fight for any damn thing. Because Leo's will give your ass a hell of a fight. <laughs> Alright. If you never fought a Leo. <laughs> Y'all rock them and sock them baby. Okay. So with this. It's about really embracing. And really knowing when to fight. When to fold them and when to hold them. Okay. Let's rock. My spirit. What information do you have? For my Leo's in love. And the baby of November. Lego. Lego. Lego Leos. If it hurt, can't hold it no more. I can't say that no more. Can't live there anymore. Well, I'm strongly connected with. Thank you, Spirit. I heard 12. 16. 6. 8, 14, whatever happened to any of you watching this video during those ages, Spirit said, let it go, forgive yourself and forgive the other person, forgive yourself for holding on to it for so long, it's time to love baby, and you can't love with that baggage in your heart, it's heavy ain't it, it's heavy, he was expecting love, on the 15th to the 30th, yeah. Some of y'all are internally conflicted about an air sign. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. I feel like this person is a liability to your finances. Some of y'all, it's an earth sign. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. But there are going to be some forced changes, Leo. And I feel like for some of you all, hmm, changes are coming in love. Changes are coming in, uh, um, yeah, some of y'all. <laughs> some of y'all. Are finding out that you're pregnant, possibly by a water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. This can also be by an Earth sign, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. But I feel like it's definitely going to cause some type of uproar as far as changes, and these changes are out of your control. Some of you could also be finding out that the person that you love has someone pregnant, has two options. But some of you, you're going to be receiving truth and clarity from a fire sign, okay, or regarding a fire sign. It has to do with two options, okay, Leo? If you have two options, some of you all, there's going to be truth and clarity about it, especially if you're dealing with another air sign or with the air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Some of you all, you in this damn water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Y'all, y'all love one another, okay? I feel like that indecisive shit. Some of y'all have a water sign that's a lover. Some of you all have a Taurus. A Virgo, a Pisces, a Libra, that is a lover. You could be finding out that you're pregnant by this person during this time, or you could be finding out that this person is going through some type of separation or uproar in their home due to an outside pregnancy, or this could be you, Leo. And Mocha love the kids. Congratulations for the kids. Don't you be cutting up about the, about the kids. You understand? Kids are a blessing. Get out your head, Leo. Some of you all are in love with your boss. <laughs> just tell them. You've been in your head about it, just stay and tell them. Some of you all, some got some of you all are gonna have um there's a financial blessing coming to a lot of you all during this time. You will receive it, baby. Receive it. I claim it over your life. Receive it, okay? Leo, some of y'all get money and love. And it has to do with your transformation. Some of y'all, y'all going to be expressing your love to a Scorpio. You actually want to stop being indecisive and actually see it on the surface. Bring it to the forefront. As above, so below. I seen it in the heavens. <laughs> in my dreams. So I know you belong to me. Some of you all, some of you all may be receiving some type of financial blessing, possibly from an earth sign or possibly an Aries. They want to start over with you. Some of you all could possibly also be invested in the business with your lover. That business will go successfully. 
Some of you all, I just see nothing but newness and success and happiness. But it has to do with an uncomfortable transformation. And, and the transformation really starts within yourself internally as well, Leo. You got to be willing to take accountability for what you allow in your life, okay? So that you can really change it. Because to truly, to truly acknowledge something, y'all, is to be willing to see it so you can fix it. Not sit there and blame your damn self. It's done. You can't take it back. Anytime an ED exists on any damn thing. You remember what we used to do? We used to, sis. I'm somebody else. I'm a whole boss out here. That's what we used to do. Okay? Remember when when they had a... <laughs> remember when you... you uh, that used to kills me. I hate when people come talking to me about what I used to do. Shit. Yeah. Shit, yeah, I mean, you know, I, I, that really bothers me, y'all. What I used to do... Yeah, I might have used to sh shake this ass, but now I'm here flipping cards. I'm, hello, somebody, you know, I'm, we, we transparent. Let's get it, okay? Some of y'all would definitely be moving away from, moving forward, possibly from an air sign. Some of y'all are definitely cutting off somebody in order to move forward in love, and you're going to have victory if you just get out your damn head. Some of y'all are, are, are kind of worried about moving away from somebody. This could be a Scorpio, y'all, or another earth sign. Capricorn towards Virgo. I feel like you, some of y'all are afraid to move away from somebody due to finances. I feel like you've been trying to give equally to both situations, but you truly love somebody and somebody else, you look at them as the coin. Okay? For some of you all, you really need to support love into yourself during this time. It's about your transformation. It's about confidence. It's about transforming how you feel about yourself and really, really, really finding the beauty in what it is that you want. Y'all businesses, business owners, your business will be booming. Claim it. Receive it because I'm claiming it over your life right now. When y'all win the lottery, damn, the only thing I want is a Starbucks gift card. Remember, guys, please. Shit. Give. Give. Some of y'all are ref refusing to uh remove yourself from situations. You refuse you're refusing to changes are happening so abruptly because you're refusing to see how much you're giving to situations that aren't fulfilling to you. And you're really needing to choose yourself during this time. Yeah. Some of y'all are fighting the change, kicking and screaming. Some of y'all this could have to do with a uh, fire sign. Some of y'all definitely going to be walking away from people during this time. And taking that leap of faith. Let that hurt go, sis. Damn, can't even see the black glare in the damn card. Ten of swords. Let that hurt go, sis. It's going to hurt. Oh, it's going to hurt. But let the hurt go and invite the lesson in. Turn your, turn your L's into lessons. Okay? Because ultimately, if you just take that leap of faith, this had to happen in order to push you forward. To go live your best life. Put that work into yourself and every, and show you that what it is that you've been putting your work into. Some of these people in your life are distractions. Some of these people are in, life, are, are your, are in your life trying to pull, trying to make you their personal puppet and pull the damn strings to your heart and pull the strings to your happiness. And you a motherfucking lying. Are you serious? Tell them to get their mind right. Some of you all. You're going to be able to move forward and actually put the work in with a Sagittarius, possibly after or during the time, possibly after a long time of not really being able to communicate with this person due to ego. Some of you all, some of you all are really needing to nurture your baby. For some of you all, it's your children. You literally, your children you really need to put a focus into your home and your children. Some of you all, if you had a passionate push to actually go create a business, create a, a branding, what you waiting for? Are you afraid of your success, Leo? Change is good. Some of you all are going to be honestly speaking to a Gemini. And I feel like you're setting your boundaries with this person, you know? And I feel like this person may make you feel like abandoned or like left out, but some of you all are going to be able to move past it. I just feel like you really need to really be vulnerable, be like vulnerable, like, 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 like what y'all say. Oh, you mean vulnerable, vulnerable. Yeah. You need to be vulnerable with this person in order to get a clear understanding because I feel like there's like this feeling that I'm feeling with this Gemini energy or this Aquarian energy of someone knows love from a heart space. And someone had to learn love through heartbreak. And you really need to find 
the center of understanding how to move them. In order for you to truly, truly, truly see the beautiful star and uniqueness that comes out of it. Okay? But I am seeing victory, happiness, success, new love. Some of y'all is in love with a cancer. You want this newness and you're going to get it. But if you just have to let go of your control around trying to attain the situation. And it's yours. Simple, simple. Okay? So this is what I have for my Leos between the 15th and the 30th of November. I love you long time. Very, very much. Much love means blessings. Much, much, much abundance, y'all. Y'all better receive it, okay? Receive receive all of the success and this happiness and this joy and this prosperity and this peace and this healing that I give to you and I say to you right now. Receive it because that is what spirit is trying to bestow upon your life. But you got to stop kicking and screaming. All right? I love y'all. If you need a read, hit me up. Deuces.